What is up, Writing 101 classmates and teacher? Today, I'm just going to be giving a quick update on a little writing assignment that I did earlier and kind of what the unit as a whole taught me. Um, Going into this, one might ask, what did you learn about writing an argument essay? And what I would say is, I really learned how to articulate my ideas in a way that revolved around a strong central theme. And for me personally, I was arguing for a relegation system implemented into American sports. So I talked about how in Europe and England and all leagues across the world for soccer, there is a relegation system where teams will get demoted if they are the bottom three or promoted if they're the top three and the central idea and central theme that i connected everything back to was the fans so when i talked about the importance of teams being upgraded or downgraded to a specific league everything had to relate back to the fans because nothing matters about sports nothing matters If the fans aren't invested, happy, or just enjoying a good time at the game. Another thing one might ask is, how did I learn this? Um, I learned this by talking with my teacher, Miss Olson. And it's important because it helps me refine my essay and make everything clear for her to read and for any other academic who wants to read my argument essay. One also might ask, what was the easiest about the writing process? For me, this was a topic that I love because I've played soccer since seventh grade and I've been invested in watching the English Premier League and watching the MLS grow and Nashville just got its own MLS team starting in February. and. So the idea of a promotion and relegation system implemented into the MLS really appeals to me because I know how important it is to the fans and how invested they are in England and the rest of the world. Um, What was really frustrating about this process for me was just finding the right way to say everything and the right, not necessarily the ideas, but the correct format to where people that aren't soccer fans can understand it. Because for me, and if I'm talking to other soccer fans, it's really easy for them to understand what I'm saying just because they hear the same stuff too. Um, But that was great. It's good for me to be challenged and for me to learn and adapt to the environment that I'm put in and for me to adjust to specific requirements that need to be in my essays. Um, I do want to continue focusing on this topic next semester i'm taking a sports rhetoric class which will hopefully give me the opportunity to write or create a podcast like we did in our fourth unit about this topic because i love soccer and i love being a fan of sports i love sports i love the environment i love the atmosphere i love the fans i love the players i just love the games and if i can help contribute to giving everyone the same experience that I have, then I'm all for that. I think my strengths in this unit are picking a topic that I know a lot about and my ability to convey my ideas after putting in the time to put it in a clear light for people to understand my ability to convey that for them to understand where I'm coming from and what I want them to see. Um, Some weaknesses is, I would say, the lack of people that know about the promotion or relegation system that's implemented in all the leagues across the world and in England, but that's kind of out of my control. And hopefully through my argument essay, they can kind of see where I'm coming from. This has been a little update slash reflective vlog. And I can't wait to see y'all next time. Bye.